Hello. Hey. Welcome back. We're gonna do only memes challenge number four. <laughs> memes. Oh yes, give me the memes. Inhale the memes. Exhale the memes. Exhale the memes. <laughs> Inject them into my bloodstream. Huh? <laughs> first one, baby. Baby. The first one. Piano, anchor, aquarium, donuts, kite. Looks like piano is winning. Keyboard cat. Maybe there's a better one. Okay, so we're gonna build keyboard cat. Yes. Baby. Okay, this is the keyboard right here. It starts right here. Now let's make it gray. Okay. Boom. Nice. Now let's make the keys. Black and white keys. It don't matter if it's black or white. Of course it matters. The black keys, they sound completely different. That's not true. They sound the same. What do you mean they sound different? The white well, key goes like... it depends like... which key you press and then it sounds different. Isn't Only that... in relation to another key, <laughs> but they don't sound different themselves. It's not like you press a white key and it goes like ding, and then you press a black key and it goes like oink. <laughs> uh, you can set it to do that on a keyboard. Oh yeah. Yeah, so you're wrong. I was right. Actually, boom, I... Boom, boom, oink. The keyboards might be superior to pianos. No. Because you can do funny sound effects. You know, but nothing gets the true beautiful sound of a real piano. Well, you can clearly hear the difference. Even if you put the keyboard on a piano setting, you can clearly hear the difference. I mean, the, the keyboard, you press a note and it just sounds fake. That depends on how good your keyboard is, but I... I think some good keyboards actually sound better than pianos. Oh? Oh? Really? Yeah. Because the sounds that it plays are all recorded in a studio on like an expensive Steinway and Sons. Yes, that is true. Your second half piano that's been sitting in the garage for five years won't sound as good. Completely out of tune. It goes on honky tonk like... <coughs> Did you know pianos detune immediately after you tune them? Yes, I heard about that. Apparently it's uh, almost impossible to keep a piano in tune. And if it detunes... It is impossible to retune. How so? Well, the wood and the stuff, it just stretches and then you can't tune it anymore. Oh. You have to buy a new one. That's why when you go on like uh, Craig's, Craigslist, whatever they use in uh, other countries, you can find a ton of piano just free. They work, but they're completely free. Yeah, but they're a pain to transport, so... Yeah, they actually lose value. In that aspect, keyboard certainly wins. It's much more uh, portable. Affordable, maintainable, audible, playable. Yeah, the keys are much lighter. <laughs> no, but really, you can go on any second-hand website and you can just get a free piano for people who don't want theirs anymore. Yeah, if you want a piano, just They're like, look. oh, just come get it. Because we don't want to pay for the shipping. You can just come get it for free. Yep. We don't want it anymore. I have a good idea. This might not be legal. But I have a good idea to uh, a way to get rid of a piano that you don't want anymore. It's probably oh. illegal. Well, here's my idea. You put a sticker on it that says, play me. And then you just roll it to the yeah. nearest. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just roll your old piano into the subway station. Yeah, just roll it to the nearest train station or bus station or whatever. And just stick a sticker on it saying, play me. Nah, uh, you can probably donate it to like a local uh, church, elementary school. What they want one though? The if problem it's is always... No, that's not the problem. The problem is no one wants to ship it. It's too hard to transport. It's so big. Yeah. Usually when you buy a piano, they just... They assemble it on the spot, right? Or not? No, of course not. Though? They just roll it in? You can't ship a piano. It's just very expensive. Why does this look so much like a rabbit? Yeah, it's something with a nose. How do we fix it? Can you put a triangle nose? Wait, let me fix it. Let me try something. Put the nose lower. Uh, nope. Now it looks like a mouse. <laughs> Seriously. This doesn't look like a cat. What can you do about it? Fix it. No, the problem is... It's a two block wide nose. Yeah, then make it smaller. How do you make a triangle with two blocks? You need at least three blocks to make a triangle like this, you know? That's how you make a triangle, but we only have two, so... It's gonna be a square. <laughs> <laughs> now it's a pig! Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Keyboard mouse, who cares? Keyboard kangaroo. No, keyboard and mouse. <laughs> <laughs> the computer combo. <laughs> well, it's supposed to be keyboard cat, whatever. Uh, whatever. whatever. We'll win next the round. The message comes across. We'll take the next round. Here we have so, a guy. Cool. Okay. Epic. Nice suit. Dressed like a Mormon. <laughs> Church duty. That's our keyboard mouse. <laughs> gaming. 
Get your gaming keyboard and gaming mouse. Nice pun. Ah, ah, uh, that is uh, cool, cool. Nice speakers, huh? Beautiful. I feel like every DJ has the yellow speakers. Yes. We have a orange guy. Donald Trump? No. Ah! The hair color is all wrong. The hair color. We have a grand piano. Oh. With the lady playing it? No, I think it's a baby grand. Look how small it is. Oh, getting technical. <laughs> Here we have a grand. Oh, that's a big boy. Uh, epic, I guess. It's really big. We have a chair and a piano. Okay. okay. And that's not a piano. Okay. Okay. And oh, look at the musical notes, notes coming off of the keyboard. Notes. Nice. Cool. Uh, wow. Cool. Cool. Wow. Cool. Cool. Cool commentary. Look at his hands. No, they're so white. Uh, uh boop. legendary. Boop. These are some of the longest keys I've ever seen. <laughs> Ten, ten. <laughs> Damn. Oh my god. Tenth place. Brilliant. Man. It's okay. We'll take second round. Second second round. Cartoon. Cartoon. Let's make Pepe the Frog. <laughs> Pepe, a hate symbol <laughs> that represents fascism. No, it's just a frog. Popularized by the hacker named 4chan. Apparently, Pepe was uh, originally from some kind of cartoon book. Really? Strip book or something. A legit one? Yeah, now someone took that picture and started using it as a meme. Okay. And then the creator of this uh, frog, this book, he started speaking out about, Oh, I created a hate symbol. Or whatever. Oh. He was gonna copyright it or something. What a d <laughs> I saw a lot of comments on the previous uh, episodes of the Dead Meme Challenge. They they are all very original, very funny. Well, dead memes, more like dead channel. What? But did you see the previous dead memes? Ooh. The first one has a million views. <laughs> oh my god! And the one after that has like six hundred thousand. Oh, oh my god! Yeah, that's why we're doing it again. Oh, that's why we're doing it. <laughs> No, it's because uh, our, our love for memes is too strong. Nice. Are we gonna fill up the background? Fine. What color? These quartz, I guess. Alright, we're done, oh, baby! Oh, baby! Look at that. Beautiful. His eyes are part of the background. <laughs> He's sweating. If this doesn't win, then I don't know what will. Maybe a better build? That's 3D? This is the best you can possibly get. What's this? What show is this? Uh, one seems to be a mermaid. Wait, wait, I recognize this T building. Something Teen okay. Super Titans? No, I don't know. <laughs> Let's see, there. Uh, this is just a TV, I think. Okay. Nothing about this says that it's a cartoon. Yes, it does. Look at that. Look at that armor snap. Uh, okay. What is this? A uh, ballerina girl. Cool. No, okay. I don't know what cartoon it is. Don't recognize it. The Minions! Minions. That's not a cartoon. <laughs> Minions is an animated 3D yeah. CGI movie. So it's not a cartoon. No. Cartoons have to be drawn. Cheated, poop. <laughs> Here we have an orange guy with a neck brace uh, pointing at a yellow... Uh, okay. Adventure time, maybe? Really? I don't know. <laughs> That's our Pepe, the frog. Monka S. Yep. Yup. Yup. You say it's gonna win? Legendary. Yes, I do. <laughs> Yes, wow. I do. <laughs> wow! Sponge SpongeBob. Cool. This nose is too short. Is it needs it? to be longer. Is he Pinocchio? Yeah. We have a kid sitting in front of the TV. Looking at a nothing. nothing. That's deep. The best cartoon is in your mind. We have Squidward, Squidward and, and Mr. Mr. Krabs. Oh my god, that is pretty good. Oh my god. Whoa. <laughs> uh, epic. Epic. Oh, Poop. baby! Poop. Horrible. Report it. Report. SpongeBob. SpongeBob. But it's bad. Cool. Oh, and we have Gary the Slime, except weird. Slime? I mean, uh, snail. Excuse me. Yeah, they use slime blocks. <laughs> bunch, bunch of, of witches. Yeah. Man. Poop. Poop. Oh, there's TNT. Oh. Oh, oh, let's see it. Let's see it. <laughs> Nothing. Hey! Oh my god, we were only two points away from second place. What? Oh my god, that's too close for comfort. 
Yeah, just make this guy's facial expression. <laughs> Too close to a comfort though. Last round, baby. Baby. Crayons, hamburger, fork, teddy bear, ring. Pedo bear. Boom. <laughs> so we're building a very old meme. It's pedo bear. Yeah. Very old. Very, very old. It's uh, just this bear that uh, appears when something when something pedo happens. Yeah. <laughs> it's not actually about pedos. No. It's just a funny uh, meme. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. We do not condone pedophilia. No. Definitely not. Definitely not, no. <laughs> that should be a given. It's just a meme. It's just a meme. Why you have to be mad? Hey, that's not a dead meme. Yeah. Very dead, huh? Memes were very different back then. The internet was different. Yeah. For example, you'd go on MySpace and then put your best friends in a friend list. Believe it or not, there was a time when people on the internet were nice. No. Yeah, you went in a random chat room and you could just chat to people and everyone was nice. Not trying to pick a fight or anything. Yeah, those times were different, man. <laughs> <laughs> no, it used to be like, oh, I know that guy from the internet. And I was like, oh, you also use internet. Yeah. <laughs> but ask someone for an email, like, hey, can I send you an email? Yeah, of course, man. Yeah, and I send one just for fun, even though they <laughs> never read it. No, there was a time when, in the days of AOL and MSN, instead of just uh, you send a message, then two hours later they read it. No, back in yeah, those it days, it was an activity in itself, you know. Yeah. Like, oh, I am a messaging. Yeah. And now I'm going. Now it's like, like I'm oh. now leaving, so I will not be messaging anymore. Nowadays, you're always connected to your yeah phone, so. You're online permanently. It's not an actual activity anymore. No. You would uh, come home from school and then just fire up MSN. And yeah. just start chatting with people. On the one hand, it's nice. We're always connected. Blah, blah, blah. But on the other hand, it's also... I don't know. Bad, I guess. Because nothing is uh, as deep. Nothing is as uh, personal. We need to hurry the hell up! We have plenty of time, though. What's the modern day version of this meme? Uh, I don't know. I think it's Chris Hansen, right? Uh, sure. And we're done! Wow! Oh! Beautiful! Pretty big. You want a background? Mm, no. We only have 30 seconds. Okay, forget about it. Yep. Great build! We're gonna win, baby! <laughs> Petal bear. Mono day equivalent is Chris Hansen. This is not the teddy bear you want uh, your kids to be playing with. Uh, it's fine. <laughs> they don't know the meaning, it's fine. Alright, time to start voting, here we go. Boom! First one, we have a uh, bloody kangaroo. Oh my god. There's a knife through the head. Cool. <laughs> it's we a chef. Chef? It's clearly a turd. What? It's a turd with a hat. Oh my god. Uh, a teddy bear. Cool. That looks uh, scary. I would not want this teddy bear. Oh. Okay. Poop. This is uh, from what? Five Nights at Freddy's, right? Are you sure? Teddy Fazbear? Teddy Fazbear, yeah. I don't know, I haven't played that game. Cool. We have... Dead Mouse? Dead Mouse. <laughs> <laughs> Brown... Ah, oh, and this one's doing something inappropriate. Reported. Boop. 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 We have... A white Cows. One. Cows? No, this no? looks like Dead Mouse again. Oh. Whatever, man. Cool. You can have cool. white teddy bears. That's ours? That's our pickle art. Pedo Bear? Yep. Nice. Well, if the Pepe got legendary, this one has to get it as well, right? Uh, we'll see, we'll ah! see. Oh! Oh! No. Here we have... Uh... That's not a bear. <laughs> Why is the head so small? <laughs> Poop. Fat one. Yep. Cool. Cool. And here we have... Cute one with pants. Cool. Cool. Wow. Cool. HD? That looks uh, molten. Molten. <laughs> cool. Cool. Hey! Hey, nice. Yeah. We did it. Baby. Good job. I'll use this as a thumbnail. Yeah. Beautiful. Or should I use Pepe? Hmm. Alright, that's it for another episode of Bill Bottle. Thank you guys for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure to press that like button. Let me know. Here's the title of the comment.